Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be answering the question, can yohimbine be effective and used as a potential treatment uh, for erectile dysfunction? So I wanna hop right into it. So yohimbine comes from the yohimbi tree. It is the active ingredient. Interestingly enough, it used to be available as a prescription drug uh, to treat erectile dysfunction, um, but isn't any longer. Now, what do we have for evidence? The evidence is actually positive. So in the main study that I could find, they used anywhere from five to 100 milligrams for two to 10 weeks. And what they found is it increased the probability of erectile function improvement versus a sugar pill. And like I said, it, it was used as a prescription drug. So the evidence seems to be there. However, there is an issue with it that I wanna point out. Um, so the biggest problem with yohimbine is that in testing, it's been notorious for having actual quantity of yohimbine in the product is vastly different from what it says on the label. So the product quality is really lacking. In fact, one of the studies, um, they looked at 49 brands of yohimbine, and what they found is that the concentration of yohimbine in the actual product was anywhere from 23% to 147% of what it stated on the label, which uh, obviously is a big problem. So in the end of the day, um, and, and real quick, one other thing I want to point out, interactions are important. You know, him being is something that uh, I would have your pharmacist look at as, as far as what other medications you're taking, are there interactions there? But the bottom line to me is, yeah, Yohimbi does appear to show some promise, but the reliability of the products is a big question mark for me. So let me know in the comments, have you used the product? Do you feel like it's reliable that you got results? Uh, those comments are helpful for me. They're helpful for other people that watch the video. Uh, speaking of helpful, I hope this was. I will see you in the next one, guys. Thank you.